I got a new tool. The Jet 10 by 15 inch table mounted lathe. Let's get into it. I'm a novice to wood turning, so this unboxing and review will come from the perspective of a newbie. I hope others looking to buy this starter lathe will find that helpful. The lathe came mostly assembled with just the spur center, thing you put the blank on, knockout rod, thing you remove the spur center with when you're done, and tool rest, self-explanatory, disassembled. The manual does show the tailstock quill center, the other thing that holds the blank, and the faceplate as disassembled too, but don't freak out and dig through the trash like me when you don't see them. They're probably on the head and tailstocks already. Once all the parts were accounted for, the next step was to set up the spindle pulley. This lathe is a variable speed model, so to select the desired RPM, you have to place the pulley belt on the right tracks of the upper and lower pulleys. To do this, relieve the belt tension by loosening the lever at the bottom left-hand side of the machine. Set the belt in the desired tracks, and then increase the belt tension before tightening the lever again. After that, I put the tool rest into place on what I've seen called a banjo carriage, which is fun. Then, got to know how the tailstock carriage worked. The lever and wheel system to set up the tailstock quill is super easy to figure out. And once the minimal assembly was done, I prepped the practice blank by locating the center of the blank and marking it as the place for the spur center mounting. Then I placed the spur center into the headstock and brought the tailstock in to hold the other side of the blank. Adjusted the tool rest close enough to the blank to support my grossly inadequate turning gouge, but far enough away to not inhibit the rotation. Then started turning. The whole process maybe took 40 minutes. Once done messing around, I remove the spur center using the knockout rod. And that's a wrap. So far, I'm a fan. Thanks for watching. For more DIY projects and shop upgrades, like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And I love hearing from you guys, so feel free to leave me a comment below. Until next time.